But I once again, that's rallying against, too. You go to the RNC, you're rallying against something. I have a really hard time believing that a lot of these people are going to rally for Barack Obama. When I spoke to a lot of people down there, when I went down to Zuccotti, they weren't Obama supporters. In fact, a lot of them, I found, were trying to rally around something. They wanted to be part of a group. They wanted to be part of something. Class warfare was in there. There were some ideas thrown in there that were similar. But Barack Obama was not at the top of that list where they could really go out during a presidential election it wasn't li I didn't get that and vibe. All right, did it I? Yes, well, charges have been filed against a man in New Jersey, a 28-year-old man, it turns out, who made repeated calls to 911. He also called police headquarters, and he said that he was the president and that he needed to speak with Tim Tebow. Very urgent, apparently. He was charged with creating false public alarms, made three 911 calls on June 10th, and when the police went to his house, they were looking for him. They couldn't find him. Perhaps the best part of the story is that the man was found inside the closet hiding under some um, pillows. So I think we oh, have a bit of a man child here. There. Some mental problems, definitely. But the police knew he wasn't President Obama. They had yeah, caller ID. Yeah, yeah, they figured that out. That's All detective right. work at its best. <laughs> <laughs>